It's a good corner, good flight, attack well, good diving header and good instincts from Anker Gran there. Parker. In by Sweeney, high hanging ball, Beckford! The top scorer delivers for Leeds United. 16 for the season now. He's been pretty sure with his handling. Just the ball pulling from deep. And look, Williams comes. Now Brave is Beckford there. Keeps his eye on the ball. Look at the leap. Hangs in the air so well. Away. Helped on at the near post by Pratt. And Flo can't get that. It's not clear properly. Trying to pass it into the near corner, and that's deflected wide. They're looking for a handball, they're only going to get a corner. You see it come across here, it comes out, it's passed back in here. And look at this, he flies across there, he deliberately handballs it. Ricks up at the other end, is onside, terrific save by Ankergren. Out of the traps like a whippet. That is really top-class goalkeeping. Like you say, he came out so quickly to block that. Foxes forward, Baude as well. Great header, back off the bar. Can they smuggle it in somehow? Leeds survive. There's McCready, just comes into the far post. It beats Prutton. And then it just gets blocked on the line. Richardson. Oh, Richardson! He scored a goal pretty similar to that last time out against Northampton, cutting in. What a sweet strike this is. Takes Williams by surprise. It moved a little bit. He does it ever so well just to cling on to this. And leads with another key game up and coming at the weekend. They all are, I suppose, for uh, Dennis Wise when you're trying to pull off what well, I think most people did see it as impossible. So that defeat leaves Crewe in 19th place, two points above Millwall and four points ahead of the bottom four. Port Vale are off the bottom on goal difference over Bournemouth. At the top, Leeds United move up three places to third, one point behind Nottingham Forest having played two games more, and four points away from the leader Swansea having completed three more games.